Hey guys, what's up? It's Maria Bell. Um, so I've been at my new place for almost two weeks and I haven't really been able to vlog because one, I don't have a camera right now. It actually accidentally went home with my sister. Long story. I had like the worst, literally the worst first day ever. Um, so that'll be like a story time later on. I love San Diego. I'm just so overwhelmed and like missing home and like all my friends. But the guys here are insanely good looking. Like it's, I'll walk outside and they'll be riding around on their bikes. So I'm thinking to keep checking back so I can give you guys updates on like how I'm feeling. I'm just gonna give a little update. One, sorry if I look naked. I swear I'm wearing a um, tube top. I'm actually parked, so I'm not driving. To be to be real with you, I'm parked. I'm miserable. I'm just gonna put it out there. I've cried, it's Saturday. I've cried about three times. I'm just very unhappy. I know like I've only been here two weeks. I'm like really disappointed in myself. Um, yeah. I know it's only been two weeks and everyone's gonna say like, give it a chance. I am going to keep trying. Yeah, I've grown up in Kids City all my life for like, 23 years and I move out here and it's just like I know it's like overwhelming and I know I need to give it a shot and I know everyone's gonna be like oh everyone's already I'm like my family my friends are all like well you need to you know try to be happier and it's like I I know that but like I'm so unhappy I hate it because I was in such a good place before I moved here that's I think the main hardest thing for me right now is like being unhappy because I it took me so long to be happy back home with myself and like with people, I cut a lot of people out in my life to be where I was two weeks ago. So it's just very disappointing for me that I'm like, like this again, cause I tried so hard. So I'm about to go to Barnes and Noble and get a book so I can go to the beach and read and I'll check back in. Um, I just wanted to get real and I'm literally about to start bawling. So I'm gonna cut this right here. It's a little bit later in the day since I had my little on camera meltdown. I went to the bookstore was there for like an hour. I got three books. I went and got Mountain Dew and sushi and I'm gonna go sit on the beach and just read. Um, I think that'll help me keep my mind off like how sad and upset I've been. Still homesick, still sad. So here's the non-glamour of moving across the country and feeling sad. So yay. <laughs> sitting in a Walmart parking lot right now and people are watching me but I really don't care I did want to give a little check-in because I'm editing this vlog currently like at home before I put this footage in and it is kind of negative and like I yeah I am very sad right now everything I know is gonna get better and it's like I was just in a very like sad terrible mood this weekend especially yesterday so you'll see whenever I'm like in my car crying basically um I did just want to like do an outro and kind of just be like I know this vlog is a little negative and sad and I seem really sad but I mean I this is a new place that I moved and I'm like still adjusting it's a huge culture shock like huge um, shout out to Trader Joe's they've been so nice and so great to me um, the people that all work there are so nice like I've literally told half of them my life story so shout out Trader Joe's for you know being my uh, therapist even though it's a grocery store, but what's good. I do have a camera coming. This has all been on my iPhone, but my camera for my sister is being sent to my house. So I should be able to, you know, have more content. I did just want to kind of say things will get better. Um, I do apologize for this one kind of being sad, but this is real. Like this is my life. I'm, you know, a little sad right now. So I'm not going to lie to you guys about that. Show you guys like how perfect my life is because honey, it's far from it. Like. This is a huge culture shock. And yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time.